May the answer you have doubts, any doubts you have? No, sir. I have revised everything. Last class, before that, everything you revised. No, sir. I am in my exam, sir. Tomorrow is my last exam, so I can't. Which exam you have? Ninth, cl ninth class or tenth class? Tenth, sir. First. The first test is going on? Yes, sir. Okay, 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 fine. Okay, let the other children join, then we'll start the meeting, huh? Okay, sir. Good evening, sir. Yeah, yeah, good evening. Hello, sir. Good evening. Good evening.
गुड इवनिंग सर yeah good evening so still two minutes is there i'll we'll just wait for few minutes so we have finished last chapter right we have linear equation now did you finish or still pending is there word problems you have done last class every word problems or is it pending tell me any one of you sir as uh, yeah like last class we finished everything okay so which chapter is to start now so we only finished the ncrt so extra some we shall we do what i do know i'm having some one uh, other book i'm having with me i'll share the complete book with means that chapter with you okay we just okay. Uh, we just finish all the means all, each and every question from there if you are having doubt you can ask okay so i'll share that pair uh, of the equation one so okay we few, few questions we do from that also wait i think i'm having with me so pair of equation no here might somewhere i'm having here itself mm, pair of lin Good evening, sir. Good evening. Real numbers, quadratic equations. Okay, we do few questions from the other textbook. Okay, I have downloaded that. Uh, in the op, keep the document scanner. Yes, here it is. so now we'll start the questions now i'm just sharing all of you on the camera now children all of you on the camera now linear equation two problems let us make your extra questions are right here extra questions okay Aditi, Tanishka, and Harshit, Sahasra, Yuan Karthik. Sir, turning on. Okay, you know what is linear equation? Which of the following is linear equation? And all just we have to do practice paper number one. I'm having with me right now. Okay, so we'll do questions. Few questions over here. See which of these can you see the questions? No. 
So which of the following uh, linear equations are in two variables? Tell me fast. Which of the following are linear equations in two variables? Just tell me the answers. A, B, all of you write in the chat box fastly. There are five equations over here. Okay. Which of the following equations are there in two variables? Answer fast. Answer me. A bit high level questions I'm just solving right now, okay? Which is not there in NCRT. So I got two answers right now. Uh, all different, different answers I'm getting over here, okay? Just keep on just messaging the answers. Okay, fine. They've given here linear equation two variables. Linear means power should be maximum one. Two variables means X and Y both should be there, okay? So be careful while writing the answers. Someone has mentioned A also. I don't know why. Linear equation means A, A is there. No, that is A square. That is not linear. Simple. Okay. So I don't know who has mentioned A and all. So see, the first equation is not at all possible because A square is coming. Like again here, what we can write? Uh, root we should remove from here. Okay. If you remove the root, what is what you will get here? You can't say this is your linear or something like that. So children, be careful here while writing it's linear or not. So simply you can't remove the roots and all. So you should be squaring both sides first. So x square is equals to 4 into y plus 3. So you'll get x square is equals to 4y plus 12. So here is also quadratic. I mean, this is also quadratic. Not, not this is not linear. This is also not wrong. This is also wrong. Okay. Next one, see, this is also wrong because there is only one variable over here. Correct? There is only one variable. Next, this one is x, y is equals to 2. x, y is equal to 2. This is linear in two variables. Is it linear in two variables? Yes, sir. No, no, x, no. y is what? How do we become power is 1? It is not, sir. X, Y is equal to 2. How you can say this is by, uh, this linear? Next, you see X, Y plus 3X, Y is equal to 4X. Mm, here, what we can say? Everything you take divide by X, Y, you can say, right? So what we can write over here? Here is, uh, if you divide here by X, Y everywhere, if you divide, what do you get? X, Y here also, X, Y here also, X, Y. We'll get here 1 by x plus 3 is equals to 4 by y, correct? So this is the answer. E part is only E is the linear equation in two variables. Only E part. Only E part you can say linear equation in two variables. Clear children to everyone? So like this, you have to check it out. Next question is write the following equations in the standard form and find their y x intercept and y intercept. So I just trying to make you understand what is standard form, Tanishka. Sir, so it's ax plus b for a linear equation. Ax plus b. Uh, this is two variable, no? Ax plus b y equals to c. Ax plus b y. Uh, plus c is equal to zero. Yes, sir. So first, what you have to do here, all the equations over here, you have to convert into a standard form. And after that, you have to find x-intercept and y-intercept. Aditi, what to do for x-intercept and y-intercept? So we have to find values for, like, we can take x is equal to so, so and so, and then we'll find y, and then, <clears throat> or we can take y, and then we'll find x. Intercept means what? What do you mean by inter intercept? So like, like on the graph, we have to plot it, right? Where they meet at the point, at a point where they meet. Intercept means it meets the x-axis, right? Somewhere. Yeah, so where it meets. If this point. is a graph, so here is what? Which intercept is this? And which intercept is this? Tell me. The above one will be y-intercept. Below will be... This will be y-intercept, correct. Intercept. 
and down will be what x intercept so at x intercept what is zero at x intercept what is zero x x is zero x eight x y intercept y is zero y is zero yeah at x intercept intercept y is zero and y intercept x is zero like that you have to convert the so first you make into a standard form first equation first thing is that second is if x is equal to zero you will get what you will get y intercept okay if you third one is if y is equal to zero then you'll get what x intercept x intercept so there are three parts you have to do all of you do question number one children question number one and just try to write in the chat box only all of you only question number you do, one you can do right now only question number one you can do Yes, only first question you do, just all the questions then later on you can do off. Only first question you try to do, then all questions later we can do later on. Okay. Other questions. Only concept you try to understand what to do in these questions. What is X intercept? What is Y intercept? What is standard form? These three things we have understood in this question. Next question 1.3. First, let's do 1.2 first, then I'll just put here 1.3. So I got three answers over here. Uh, Medha Hansini, Harshit, Harshit has mentioned here in answer. 